All right, today I wanted to show you how I make my healthy breakfast. I don't know if you can see me or not. All right. How I make my healthy breakfast. I put clay and I'm trying to do everything the business experts tell me to do. I'm chasing the dream. So one of the things they say is be authentic, make yourself, uh, video yourself as you're doing everything you're doing. And no, it's not narcissistic, because um, I don't really care if people like me or not, although I don't want them to hate me, so, but I need, we have this freezer, this refrigerator that freezes everything, it's really disgusting. I never feel like cutting the watermelon, so I just dig out the middle like a <laughs> I should call this the lazy man's way to work. Um, so yesterday I bought some fruit so I could have a nice fruit salad. So I'm going to mix up one of them. Tom is out mowing the lawn and He is drenched. He came in this morning. He had been weeding. I was sleeping. But I wasn't lazy. I was reading that book that told me to do this video. So he was reading and he, uh, I mean weeding, he was just drenched from head to toe. It's been so humid. It's just been this amazing, I love the heat. Like I could live in 80 and 90 degree weather, but the humidity is what gets to you. So. Anyway, now he's out mowing the lawn, and I figure he's going to want something to eat when he comes in. I'm really not the subservient kitchen type of wife at all. <laughs> Anyone who knows me knows that. But I, um, I think I'd rather be in here cutting up a fruit salad and making waffles than out there on the lawn with this humidity. So we've got these beautiful organic strawberries that I paid $7 for that are now frozen thanks to our dying refrigerator. Um, that is really too bad. They were very nice. So I'm going to put them in and I'm going to put some grapes in that should be really organic, but they're not because they were on sale and once in a while you're like, I'd rather pay $2.99 a pound than $5.99 a pound. Um, so, cut this up a little, get it all ready to eat. I'm getting hungry. I usually try not to eat for at least 12 to 16 hours. I do it intermittent fast. Lately, I've been getting away from that because I've been, um, I've been hungry when I wake up in the morning. I've been hungry at night too. I've been hungry a lot lately. So. You know what I'm feeling really good? That was about 25 years every day when I woke up and just felt crappy. Like, I, I just couldn't do the day. I was just tired and I had this, um, sick feeling, like usually my throat hurt, or um, my head kind of was foggy and fuzzy, and my joints hurt, and I just, I couldn't think clearly. And now, when I wake up in the morning, except for today, because I, I probably was up till five in the morning reading, um, I wake up and I feel great, like, I feel like I do at four in the afternoon, whereas I used to just wake up and... It would take me probably four or five hours to just get in a groove and start to feel better. So I'm going to leave these strawberries out because they're going to be good on the waffles. Here's our little salad. This is my favorite summer salad. Now I should throw in some nice blueberries, but I really like it this way. All right. Now I'm going to do my super easy, easy peasy. easiest 
recipe pretty much that I've ever done. And it tastes so good. I'll do it with three. One. Two. Three bananas. These are going to go in the compost pile. So I can put more grapes in here. filter, which I'm going to turn this a little so you can see it. It's an aqua true. I filter all my water. We've got pretty good well water, but I'm thinking there's pesticides running around. One. And why don't I bring this here? Three. Now the recipe calls for vanilla and salt and sugar. But since I'm skipping the salt and sugar and I ran out of vanilla, we're done. So all I'm going to do is put this puppy on, blend it, and then it's ready. So, let's see. I am my waffle iron out. I'll meet you back in a few minutes. All right. The waffle machine is ready to go. I plugged it in and the light came on and I haven't mixed this yet. It's just been sitting there. So, mix this. All right, my trusty ninja. If you let it go a minute, it becomes smoother. If you mix it like really quick, it's going to be more chunky. I'm going to rinse this out right away because it saves me time. Bella, she thinks I'm talking to somebody. Alright, that's clean. And yeah, I'm using broke this again. This happened to me before. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Alright, I'm not going to be making waffles for a while. This is not the first time this has happened. machine works, this is a really easy, great breakfast. 
For now, I'm gonna have fruit salad. So I'm trying to fix this. This would be the way, I have to be careful because it's so hot. This would be the way it would sit, but then it wouldn't come out. back end. So, Tom finally came in from mowing the lawn and he's going to eat his waffle. Getting a big glass of water so he doesn't die of dehydration. And isn't this so interesting, Paul Henry? <laughs> I mean, you're guilty. <laughs> la 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 la. I feel like the Truman Show. Here he comes. Here comes Truman. How would Truman say? Don't try to be funny. <laughs> Paul said we have to try not to be funny. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, so. Oh, aren't you cute? So, um. Oh, now I hear the cat. What did Truman say? He said something every morning. Oh, he did, he did say something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that was kind of the precursor to a lot of things, wasn't it? It was like a prophetic movie. It's reality TV. It's reality TV. And now this reality TV is let's watch Worker Tom eat his waffles that I made. 
So I broke that waffle machine again. What? I, you know how it, it just falls out of its groove? And it fell, and then I had to unplug it, and I had to wait, and then I messed with it a while, and then it, I got it. I was going to get you, but I couldn't okay. really get you. Mm. Yeah. I couldn't hear you. No. We'd have to go to the end of the world where I was. I know, and I don't want to do that, because there's grass everywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. So I was probably up to like four in the morning reading that crazy book. It was crazy. Crush it. Yeah. I was reading all about YouTube videos and he was saying you have to have people follow you around and you have to document every single thing you do on, on your video camera. And that's what Paul told us. And so that's what I'm trying to do. And so that's why today I documented me making waffles and now I'm documenting you eating the waffles. The other thing he suggested is this, there's this Musical.ly app, all these little teenies. Mm -hmm. Teens are on it. Have you heard about that app? Mm -hmm. Oh, why'd you say mm-hmm? Oh, so there's this crazy little app that, um, swipe to see more to start your musical feed. Terms of use, oops, oh, I have to agree. Ew. Wow. I agree a lot. Oh my gosh. Good <laughs> grief. Okay, but I don't even know where to hit agree. Just agree. Fine. Alright, so see all these people, they just do this and they do like music videos and. Walmart. I guess so. Allow access to camera, allow access to microphone. Now we're gonna be on there. See? Pick a sound. <laughs> God is a woman. God. So there's hot songs. Oh, there's hot one kiss. I don't know any of these songs. Do they have anything like Oklahoma? <laughs> this is for you, Kate. Um, trending featured comedy challenge here first. My favorites. Oh, I don't have any favorites yet because I just went on. Well, how do I pick a song I even know? Blah, blah, blah. That sounds good. How about I'm a mess? Should we do I'm a mess or blah, blah, blah? Sangria wine. That shit. That one we should have done in the barn last year. It's all cleaned up. Don't worry. Um... Well, this is really weird. What? Oh no. Wait, we're under my phone. That's a mole. Wow, it's a big one. Yeah, that's not a tick. Okay. Ugh, you're icky. Alright. Yeah, that's a mole. Okay. You're okay. But I should look at the rest of you. You're just all dirty. Mm hmm. I can't tell, you know, I can't tell what's a tick and what's dirt. Yeah, I know. Don't worry about it. I'll take a shower. After I'm done with it, we'll drop. How long is it going to take you? <laughs> no, we don't have all day. What? We have things to do. What do you want to do? Um, well, we were going to work on the shower in the bathroom this weekend, and we needed the screens and the doors, and we needed to mouse proof more, critter proof. And I probably want you to move that bench that's in the barn right now because I don't think I want it in there. And I might want to move that thing that's in the, the meditation room into the barn and put stuff in there because it has a glass container. And I think I want to move those tables out of the barn and put them into the art room and move the stuff from the meditation room into the barn. And we're doing all this this weekend. Now we're doing all that in the next 10 minutes. Yeah. After I figure out how to do this, this musically, because it's very important, according to the book. Um, he also said you should spend like six to eight hours a day on Twitter. Well, like, he says you have to work 16 to, well, I already work 16 hours a day. Well, there's a Taylor Swift, but it's probably a new one and I don't know it. I know. You'd never get a business going that way. Well, your business is you. It's your brand. 
That's what he said. Yeah. Yep. All right. I don't think about you. I want something from Mamma Mia. Miss Summer Madness. I want to see what blah, blah, blah. Okay, it tells you to shoot with the sound, so you get to hear it first. All we ever hear is blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's try that one. You can try it. So what's it do? I put you on the internet. Oh. Lab, but I don't hear anything. It 
kicked off. Ha. Private, only myself. Ugh. Can I have this last one? Yeah. <sighs> oh boy. If you want to publish, if you want your own thing, you have to uh, give them your birth date. That's embarrassing. They just want to plug your information. That's yeah, I know. They want to see who's using their thing. They just want your information. That's what it's about. Who knows what they're going to do with it? I don't know. Your account is public and your public videos will be visible to everyone. To switch to a private account, go to privacy settings. I don't have a following yet. Imagine. Saint contacts to find there's no friends there. I don't think I have any friends in Musical.ly unless they read the book. What a shame. No friends in your contacts are using Musical.ly. <laughs> okay, but where's my video that I just made? One Musical.ly. Tap cover. There it is. All right, now I can show you all on this, what this was like. <laughs> that was actually really fun. I could get addicted to doing this. I love that song. Okay. That's fun. I don't have a bio or anything yet. Okay, if I go back here, I can make another one. Pick a sound. One kiss. Okay, we're going to do one kiss. my shoulder. You have to hold it. Mm. I guess you're not supposed to do this when you're old. Well, it didn't do anything. You hit no next. I better go to the privacy settings and make sure that didn't yeah. <laughs> do anything. Mm. You probably have to stop each one private. Oh, that would be terrible. And then you can watch. And this might be actually shooting before the music. I don't know. That's the microphone. I always wanted to be a rock star. Okay, this is going on. Okay, that's a good idea.